Do you apologize to them for us being late? Yes. <laughs> Not that. officially okay. yet. Yeah. <laughs> I kept pushing the time of the stream back. Mm-hmm. So people, yeah. It technically is supposed to start at 1.30, so we're only three minutes late, wow. so we're good. Mm. <clears throat> good. Um, now I hear you yeah. through the thing. That's so funny. Wait, really? Yeah. You hear me through this? No, no. I just heard the the replay of the YouTube, like, yeah. now we're just you going live it? on the, like, I heard you say that. Yeah. I, oh, that okay. So that's why I got to keep that quiet. Because um, that was on the, yeah, I was listening to it here. Okay. Um, <laughs> my head is like spinning right now trying yeah, to figure so stuff out. <laughs> I have like 20 sure. outputs going on on my computer right now. The computer like, is going to die in a second. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hello, welcome to everyone um, joining our live read. We are very glad that you guys are here. Um, you guys good? Any bathroom breaks before we start? <laughs> oh, I forgot. Oh, <laughs> Kaylee's going to get yeah. that down. <laughs> decapitated. If you, you, yeah, move the chair how, however much you need. Just block the entrance if you have you to. Oh. to or even just move the lamp like completely behind you so you can do it or something. I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> okay, while we're trying to figure this out, <laughs> for anybody watching this live, this is what we're going to do. You all see that timer in the top left corner. As soon as we start this chapter, we're on chapter 35. I'm going to get this timer going. Um, I'm going to show you as we go. So it's going to start like it's starting right here. And then that's the time that we are going to be at in the audiobook chapter. It's not the entire time of the audiobook chapter, but that's the time that we're going to be in the audiobook chapter. Thank you. For chapter 35, for the Jim Dale version. Um, and then the timer is going to go on. If we pause, we're going to just try to stop it and then um, maintain it. And we're going to just kind of, we're going to try as best as we can. We're gonna talk a little bit during. Do you the, not want us thing. to stop? Not at all. Oh, okay. I definitely. I, that's. I feel like that'd be more entertaining oh, if we stopped. I can't really talk um, so we're definitely gonna do stuff like that. This might be rough. I don't know how any of this is gonna work at the moment, but um, I'm pretty excited. Should be. We'll figure it out. Uh, give me a second because I gotta re- redo all this. Yeah, we're gonna do regular speed. Like, yeah. Please. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Remember last time we did it? You I were like spinning. Yeah. yeah. You're like, I, I cannot do this. I just read the chapter because I'm like, I can't do this. Um, I am going to throw a link in. Okay. Here is for anybody on the live stream. That is a version that someone sent me. Um, don't know the legality of this, <laughs> but uh, if you click that, we are on chapters 35 and uh, 36. We're going to do both of those chapters today, and then uh, we're going to do live reads of those. So that's all we got going on right now. So if you want, you can, I yeah. think those are the same time frame. Um, yeah, if it's a train wreck, it'll be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> you hear buzzing? In yours? Well, wait until it do starts playing and see if you can still hear I have really good hearing, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I do not. <laughs> and then the buzzing goes away when I take this out? Yeah. Or does it still buzz? It still buzzes. Hmm. Hmm. Are you hearing my no, neighbor? No, it's like a humming. It's like a hmm. No, it's not that. The song, my neighbor. How That's annoying right. of a humming. It sounds like wind in a tunnel. Like, that's like the humming sound. You don't hear that? Whatever. When something's playing, I'm sure it'll go away. If it's, if it's bad, we can swap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, you guys can swap too. Um, why is Siri on my computer going like crazy? Sorry. All right. For those online, are you guys ready? Let me know. It's going to take 20 seconds for me to figure that out. But are you guys ready? We're ready. Finally. Wait, is it are you ready? No, no, no. That's, I to. think that's great. I think right, that's, cool. yeah. I have to. <laughs> <laughs> um, the sign for pause, just start talking. You can even, I think if you take your AirPod out, it'll stop it for all for of everyone. us, maybe. Wow. I think. Cool. I, I'm not going to bet on that. Mm. Well, I can't talk clear. with it in, so. Yeah. Let's mm. give it a shot real real quick. Yeah. Um, like, I can't hear my. No, my internet just went out. No. Okay. It's on two headphones now right now. Did my internet really just go? Oh, are you kidding me? My internet's
that just swapped. <laughs> I should have brought stuff for dinner. <laughs> yeah. I'll go home and get it and we'll bring it back. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sorry. I don't know what the heck is going on. We had a little internet issue right here, so I think we're good now. Nice. <laughs> People are quoting the books us. <laughs> All right, I think we're good. Um People don't want to wait anymore for us to <laughs> figure things out. <laughs> guys, give me a second, all right? All right. Can you guys hear this? Yes. Yes. Okay. Give me a second. Wow. Did you start it? Mm, we're going to, I'm going to let everyone know when we start it. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work. Maybe I should have just done a no latency so we can, I don't know. I'm th out thinking out loud. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> We are going to start. Give me a second. <laughs> but not. <laughs> We're going to start. But not really. <laughs> I was just kidding. Um, I need to figure out how to. Okay. I think I wrapped my head around this. <laughs> I'm just thinking out loud. All right. Are you ready? We're starting. The clock is going. Um, We're starting right now. Hmm. <laughs> Prophecy. <laughs>
That's what Jen wishes she could tell Voldemort right there. <laughs> yep.
interesting. <clears throat> Hold on, let's stop here just for a second. <laughs> you said that was very interesting? Uh, yeah. Well, because... Oh, so much. There's so much. <laughs> um, is it just me, or was that a brief moment of time travel? So the hourglasses shatter back to the wall, shatter again. So it was like repeating a moment. So um, in my mind, from that one line, it confirms that these clocks all have some time power. Not just to tell time. He loves maybe that in time the power, I will say that. <laughs> <laughs> As if my mind did not work, I will and say that. And a grandfather clock was already knocked into too. So whatever's happening with these clocks means something. This is where all the time turners are. All the time turners. Are you saying that? Or are you just no, going into No, this Danny's? is where they keep all the time turners. <laughs> it's just a fact. So, so. Oh, how am I supposed... That was said. I don't understand. <laughs> that's just like, that's the room where all of time, all the time turners. Yeah. My brain, sorry. I'm mm. like in the book and I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Interesting. Because a bunch of them broke. And what does it mean when they break? <laughs> Is it possible they just traveled in time? I like right how now? that's what you kids. pulled out of this. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what else? Well, they made a comment, and I was like, I like went back to the beginning of the paragraph. I was like, what are they commenting on? Because <laughs> Danny goes, hmm, interesting, because everyone was waiting. They're like, oh, the part that Danny's going to love is going to come up. <laughs> so... <laughs> they know you well. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Wait, I'm also wondering, like, just currently, what the deal is with the prophecy. Like, Harry can hand it to them, but they can't take it from him. So that's why I'm I'm thinking that's the case. But then well, they're trying Bellatrix to take it from him. Tried to just Accio the thing, and he protected it. So it's just weird that they're not killing Harry. They like kind of need him maybe. Mm -hmm. And then I'm wondering they can't break the prophecy either. I think unless they're manipulating Harry into breaking it himself, um, because I partly had that instinct. Just smash it on the ground right now. Because mm -hmm. it doesn't feel like yeah. what they want to happen. Yeah. But then again, they could be manipulating him to get him to break it. Maybe he's the only person who could break it. And they've manipulated him so well so far. Mm. I don't know what you <laughs> But then I'm like, what do you do with the prophecy when you have it? I don't know. I don't think it's... Maybe Voldemort needs to smash it so he can like see what it says. Mm. Or did he already know what it says? But what does this do anyway? If you smash it or you learn about it, what does it do? Yeah, that's what like, I'm Like it's just going to change history or it's going to change the future? And it sounds like Voldemort already knew what the prophecy was back when Harry got the scar to begin with. So That's probably why he went after him. Yeah, so right? why would anything change now? Maybe they're in the time turner thing, like you said. And what do you do with the prophecy? Is there anything else you can do with it? Can you bring it through that archway? Can you feed it to the hummingbird? Mm. Can you install it in a clock and go back <laughs> and time turner to the original thing? <laughs> What the? I don't know. I mean, what, what were the other rooms? I'm trying to think if there's anything else in these rooms. There's a brain room. You and why remember. didn't Dumbledore tell Harry about the specifics of it? Yeah. Great question. Why doesn't? Why does Dumbledore not tell Harry this? I think whatever the prophecy is, Harry wasn't ready for it. And it seems like if Harry did know about the prophecy, he would have gone chasing after it from the first glimpse he <laughs> yeah. got from Voldemort's little... Uh, mind games yeah so now we know his dreams were Voldemort all along um and we thought harry had the advantage like ooh, surprise but really it was part of Voldemort's plan <laughs> so <laughs> it also seems weird that the good guys don't want anyone saying Voldemort. yeah the bad guys don't want it i'm like what for different reasons for different reasons like but the same fear end. and then out of reverence yeah how dare so you speak strange. his name and like so it kind of uh, He's changes a half the vibes blood. a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> and they don't know. I know. But he's not really half blood. He's like a quarter blood. But Hold like, more? no, Harry. Oh, oh, Harry. As of now, it seems, right? Because it's. Well, his so? dad's uh, a pure blood. Oh, wait. His mom is a. Mo I yeah. keep forgetting that. And mom is Muslim I thought mom. it was like what the mom was. Never mind. <laughs> and oh because you're thinking of like the family and the mom's yeah. family and Patricia yeah. and be. all that Jen is yeah. looking into genetic theory right now with like <laughs> yeah. you know that box you created in science class in high school yeah. <laughs> dominant traits yeah. Yeah. yeah you guys should have each created that wall 
of like you <laughs> figuring everything out yeah. this is genealogy <laughs> i'm picturing that meme yeah yeah the guy against the wall with all this yeah. stuff from uh, mm-hmm. it's always sunny good you guys ready no idea what you're talking about <laughs> <laughs> just a quick it's brief so stop slow i know because you're ready <laughs> you do it two times the speed right i do one like and 1. a half 5? i think yeah. gotta do it Normal. Or 1.25. <laughs> Sorry. Right. It's so you guys ready? Slow. <laughs> Headphones on. Yeah, no. All right, we're starting again in three, two, one, go. Can you guys hear? Do you hear it? You guys hear it? Hold on. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, so you gotta like, switch yeah, every time. All right, <laughs> three, two, one, go. <laughs> Imagine that mental picture. <laughs> you can't oh hurt a baby.
No. What? Why is he doing that? He kicks the wand? I feel like he should keep the fragments all the same. We'll talk about that in a bit.
like drunk <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's on laughing gas <laughs>
Oh. <laughs> it's my guy. Go devil. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Oh my goodness. Finally. <laughs> About time. Where have they been? <laughs> Oh my. <laughs> nice job. <laughs>
Wait. Pause. Hold on. Oh. It's not that important. Yeah. But I don't understand how I thought when they, they all came, it would be over. Like <clears throat> five kids or whatever could outlast them so long and now these yeah. adults come and i'm like oh this will be over soon and they're still the kids are still the ones fighting yeah i know <laughs> it's so ridiculous so there's a few things that people are even mentioning on chat that <coughs> she keeps saying that the death eater is missed by an inch because you know like the stormtroopers and lord and Latin yeah Latin and star, star wars. wars they keep missing they they are terrible shots yeah but people are always shocked of how um these kids are able to survive. But one thing, they're all... Like, none of the Death Eaters are hurt, really, or anything like that. There's one of the guys, maybe. But the kids are mangled and a mess. Yep. So now they're on, like, equal fighting terms. Like, it's Harry and Neville, and they're the last two with all these other Death Eaters around. And it's like... Now I know, but now the on. adults, come on. They should be better. Yeah. They're still good. Like, Bellatrix is <laughs> pretty darn freaking good at what she does. She's evil, but she's a, she's a very skilled witch. I also feel like the Death Eaters are willing to do damage and the yeah. kids are just, they're, yeah. they're not ready emotionally for it. Yeah. So they're like, oh no, he's a baby. You can't hurt him. But then the problem is the other Death Eaters come along and they can fix things. You know, like even the ones that uh, were petrified, you know, like frozen, did they come back now? Were they fixed or are they still frozen somewhere? But I feel like yeah, they. it sounds like they were fixed if all the Death Eaters are now here. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, most of them. I, I guess there's one or two probably still in rooms. The baby man, Death Eater. Hmm. He's probably still wandering around. Yeah, he's yeah. trapped somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, they're still outnumbered. Yeah, The good for guys sure. are not, not looking great. Mm -hmm. That was a... <laughs> I <laughs> right? just can't get over yeah. that. Because yeah. I'm like, serious? Tunks? Mad Eye movie. It's like the best of the best, right? Yes. Oh, yeah. Why? They should be able to fight them I thought they would have been a lot of a faster... Well, anyways. Now we're on. Mm. We're all on equal footing here, so... No, they're outnumbered. They're not equal footing. The, the Death, death eaters. Who's, who's outnumbering who? The Death Eaters are outnumbering yeah. them, I feel like. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, you guys ready? Ready. All right, give me a second to start everything up again. Ready... Starting in three, two, one. Sheesh.
Teared up, didn't anybody else? Yeah, <laughs> oh, I guess I'd rather serious than the kids. <laughs> I knew that was gonna be your guys' reaction. I know we're like over here. Hold it back. Hold it back. <laughs> you guys are like, I lost the least. It's serious. I kind of, I kind of feel you, feel you guys too. I'm though. still worried about Moody. He's on the ground, and blood coming from. His I know. Head. I know. That is sad, but. What about Hermione? I'm worried about all of them. Yeah. Where is he I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Too late. Well, <laughs> anything Ooh. to discuss? Are you guys ready for the next one? I can't do it this slow. It's too slow. <laughs> oh, wow, we gotta. Me. We gotta. It's driving me crazy. <laughs> this one's shorter, right? Yeah, this I'm one's a short one. About Neville had his dad's wand, so that's interesting. And now it's broken. He's borrowing Hermione's, and Hermione's wand is not working. I'm assuming because he's not pronouncing things correctly. Mm -hmm. um, Maybe. But it's also not his wand. But could his dad's wand choose him? Or is he now going to get a wand that can actually choose him? And Neville's going to go from good to great. <laughs> um if he survives, <laughs> we don't yeah. know. Um, yeah, wow, that was a lot going on. And d wait, the one Death Eater couldn't talk because in the room with the books, Hermione or Harry, one of them hit the guy so he couldn't speak. Yeah. But then he Hermione still was able to do to. some kind of thing with purple at Hermione. So I'm like, what did he just do? I don't know. He's he casting speak, right? a spell without speaking, right? Mm -hmm. And yes. that, that seems like the kind of thing you should learn, you know? Yeah. Nonverbal magic, yeah. Yeah, or Neville really could have used it in this case. Yeah. But I guess they didn't learn it. But he could be saying the words, it's not coming out. Like, 
Oh, interesting. Maybe. I don't know how that works. Do you think the <laughs> wand can say it and like the wand understand? Mm. Once you're really connected to your wand. And it was purple. I feel like that was the first time we saw purple. Mm. I, we don't know much about the, the colors green, yet. Red, but red, yeah. yeah, lots of red for the stunning. Green for curses? Is that a thing? Or is that just a magic yeah, issue? Green. Right? Green. Mm. green is Vanak Davra. Yeah. Only a so, Vodakadavra. I'm sure there's another, like, some minor spells that are maybe green, but Avada Kedavra is a green one. So Harry is dodging death. Uh, the That's death, intense. The oh, killing wow. curse. Real bullets. Yeah, like, legit. Hmm. What's up with the baby Death Eater? Does someone, like, cast a spell on him so he just, like, goes becoming a baby and adult? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Like, he was in the time thing. Yeah. In the time room. So, like, oh, okay. ha I, I think half of him, happening. yeah. Okay. Half of him fell into that. Right or the, was that the what was it? What room was it? Yeah, in the one with all the yeah. clocks. He yeah, yeah. Fell into the hummingbird. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, the bell that was shaped. Like changing, right? Yeah, because only his head was in yeah. it. Yeah, <laughs> it like, didn't have edges. That was so interesting. Yeah. So what if you just did like a quick somersault through that thing once yeah. a day? You yeah. know, so you'll never age. Forever. Just like you know. <laughs> yeah. Flower, bloom, and grow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, yeah, for real. It's like what that. What else did you sing at Disney? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're right. It's about time. <laughs> um yeah some people want me to explain a few things to you but i can't explain some of the stuff quite yet because that'll happen later in books um i can't tell if it's a good or a bad thing that the prophecy smashed so mm -hmm. big no one heard it right eyes, now that kind of confirms that we're seeing trelawney um in ghosty form kind of mm -hmm. giving the prophecy originally to dumbledore we still don't know how any of that works. And is this a good or a bad thing? Like, mm. the Death Eaters wanted the prophecy, but did they just want to smash that? it? Yeah. I don't even understand. I don't, know. I don't think so, but... It doesn't even make sense, because you have Dumbledore and you have Trelawney. Just ask them what was said. I don't understand this <laughs> yeah. whole globe thing. Well, like, it, it, must, it must mean more. Like, Obviously, but like it, what? Then what happens, though? Like... It's destined to come true until you smash it, or it's like maybe that's why Voldemort wanted the prophecy because he didn't know all the details of it. He thought he but knew it's what a it prophecy. Was. So what does are the what are the true? details? I didn't think it, it would know. be that detailed. A prophecy. But Harry Potter? Question mark. Yeah. Well, I guess this confirms it was Harry Potter because Harry was able to pick it up. So know. maybe that alone confirmed something for Voldemort. Now he's like, all right, confirmed. It's me and Harry. And he tried to kill Harry the first time. Um, but what is Voldemort even going to do with that? Nothing now. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> but also, Harry was just like, yeah, this precious thing that we don't want to break. I've got a good idea. Let's just smash like hundreds or thousands of Yeah, I know. Leave. I'm like, Harry, you literally don't know anything. What are you doing? And I guess that also confirms they don't want to smash this thing or they would have just smashed it on the shelf <laughs> yeah. because they could smash it from a distance. So there must be something more you have to do with it to Unlock understand the it, power. learn it, or change it. Yeah. I don't know, but I think Harry was being a little crazy trying to smash all these prophecies. Like, <laughs> I mean, no life and deal. death. Yeah. You know, I guess you're, you're right. not really Desperate thinking times. through. <laughs> let's save all of these and let's <laughs> yeah, all but, die. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he's a kid, but it just feels like... Um, well, there was no way know. out. What? what else would they have done? You're yeah. removed, take, Danny. Take you're, the L. You're, you know? you're watching from afar. If you're placed in this situation, you're breaking whatever you can to survive. I guess At so. least I am. I, I'm actually just surprised, though, he didn't just break the one in his hand like he really mm. thought it was like yeah. precious he wants to like carry it around only after malfoy said something yeah he was going to yeah. break it i feel like because he doesn't care about it and then he's like this is everything you ever wanted to know which i don't know if they're manipulating him again hmm. to make sure he didn't break it trelawney didn't tell him for a reason but now luke just told him mm -hmm. hmm. but he doesn't know what it is and what's the deal with this archway? <laughs> what is this? This is a <laughs> death arch? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, what is the archway? I feel like this is Harry us. literally was like thinking about walking through it. Not only now, but the first time they saw it because he was drawn to it. But and he could like hear voices a little bit on the other side. He was already like dead and then he fell into it, right? So then he's gone forever. I don't know. 
that's what it seems like. It seems like he's Malibu. gone and there's nothing he can do, but Harry heard voices on the other side. Does that mean you can still communicate with people? Yeah, maybe they're dead. You have dead. visiting hours? You can show no, up and be like, no, serious, what's up? You hear me in there? No, it's like people in hell calling you in. Come here, yeah. my Ooh. precious. Like, uh, oh, wow. what's, the, what's the other Disney movie? Hercules. All those like mm. little Hades. Uh, and all the people swimming around in the... Sty the sticks, what is it? The styre. I yeah. don't remember any of that. But I watched it once. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, that's what Yikes. I was thinking. Uh this is yeah, a lot's going on. <coughs> Glad Dumbledore is there though. And I yeah. love that they're Finally. scrambling away from him. Yeah. Like just the sight of And him, he's just terrible. whipping them back. Yeah. Like oh yeah. Mm-hmm. At first I didn't think that they knew all the kids were there. And then how did they find out? Uh, the people in the order. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. It is. It is weird. They must have all been doing something together. Because when it's this urgent, they're not going to be like, "Let's gather, all of us at uh, the same time, and then go in." I feel like they would have just run right in as they arrived. So they all arrived together. But what were they doing? Maybe someone was on guard. Put someone on the tracker on him. Well, they were guarding <laughs> the. Uh, school, they were though, guarding like, the. Aren't they the still going to? <laughs> you go. No, I didn't know they were still doing rounds of guarding the Department of Mysteries, and maybe mm. one of them mm. noticed. Like uh, it was time for a like a, a shift change, yeah. and they're like, "Uh oh, somebody didn't show up." <clears throat> yeah, whoever was on shift was not there where they were supposed to be. Yeah. yeah. Um, or they're already gone. So yeah, who else is dead? Yeah. Mrs. Weasley. No! <laughs> oh Wait, actually, that's so weird, because Sirius was at the meal. He was one of the 13. Oh, my so gosh. Yeah, this is either, meal. Either he got up first, or... You it, never it actually said Sirius, death. though, so I feel no, like I, your I theory is wrong. No, I didn't say Moody, either. Hmm. I guess we'll find out if somebody else at that table died first. Because the, the thing, the <laughs> saying is that it, whoever leaves the table first is going to die first. So <clears throat> either it was Moody or Sirius or somebody else. It couldn't be. Ooh, Ginny did get hit in the face. <laughs> is she going to die? I think she is she dead in another room alive. right now? It was only a stunning spell. Yeah. And McGonagall took four of them to the chest. So I think she's fine. But I am worried about Mrs. Weasley. If she was on guard duty, that would make a lot of sense. <laughs> but I don't like it. Um, <laughs> Danny, I'm going to read you a quick passage. <clears throat> He's not your son, said Sirius quietly. He's as good as, said Miss Weasley, Mrs. Weasley fiercely. Who else has he got? He's got me. Yes, said Mrs. Weasley, her lip curling. The thing is, it's been rather difficult for you to look after him while you've been locked up in Azkaban, hasn't it? Sirius started to rise from his chair. <laughs> it was right in front of my eyes the whole time. You guessed Ginny oh and Molly, but oh, so there's a lot of debate on this one whether like wow. who stood up first and Rising what actually constitutes from, a meal. Right? What what I is assume you yeah? Have to leave, but yeah. Wow. So that would be good because it means Moody's still alive. <laughs> Jen's just and like we don't have to roll her eyes. Mrs. Weasley. <laughs> oh my goodness! Started but to would rise. you have been fine? I mean, out of all of them, dying. I think it was a noble way to go. Yeah, serious. I like him, but of all the people at that table, he's in he's in the lower half in my mind. Mm -hmm. I was gonna yep. say like mm -hmm. from his perspective, from Harry's perspective. Mm -hmm. that yeah. Who else does he have right now? Yeah. yeah. But I feel like I mean he probably regardless was gonna get. Like, he was so arrogant. Like, this is the best you got. And I'm like, why would you say why? that? No. I feel like you just let... Yeah. I know, but, like, did that encourage her to do even better, harder? Because it would for me. Probably. <laughs> like... And they're... Oh, yeah? Right? So, I don't know. It just feels weird. Like, did they grow up practicing together and playing and, like, dueling? And um, it feels like that would be a pretty epic showdown. But they know each other's strengths and weaknesses, maybe. So it just felt... A little much his arrogance was his undoing which does seem a little fitting 
Um, that reminds me of Creed three. <laughs> <laughs> His arrogance. Don't give it away. Undoing. Well, well, well. Yeah, I'll watch it. Huh. Hmm. That's sad. Bellatrix is yeah. something else. I know. She is a piece of work. Can Dumbledore just oh like, get rid of him? She is. Yeah, she's okay. Wow. He's right in All front of, of my eyes. Because even Lucius <laughs> <Is> was <he laughs> starting to rise. Danny, you what cannot even fuck? explain to me. Because when we were in that chapter, um, we were you were going over it and you were like, all right, there's 13 at this table. And in my head, I'm like, he's figured it out. He knows that Sirius oh is going to die. And then you said Ginny. And then you said yeah. Mrs. Weasley. And I remember this is this is a part <laughs> where in my head, I was like, shoot, this might be too over because Danny might actually catch me doing this. But about a minute after that discussion, I was like, yeah. okay. And this other this other like little line happens. Wow, and I read the line where Sirius, <laughs> Sirius oh, rises from his chair. <laughs> And oh I thought I saw goodness. a little smirk on your face. I'm like, crap, did Danny figure no, it out? I totally missed it. <laughs> <laughs> that is so funny. Oh, my goodness. Good job. Oh, oh my Danny, gosh. Yeah, I'm, I'm relieved because I like Mrs. Weasley and Ginny more than Sirius. Um, but that's so interesting. I would not think of that as leaving the table, mm -hmm. but in a very technical sense so, it is. Yeah. And Calvin just uh, – he just wrote in this her – um, Trelawney's phrasing was when 13 dine together, the first to rise will be the first to die. Oh, so I was, I was wording. trying wow. to piece this together because when you mentioned, because this is like a common under, like common little, like, okay, 13 are at the table. Like this is Harry. It's not like Canon Canon, but Harry Potter fans look yeah. back at this and they're like, Oh, she foreshadowed serious dying here. Yep. Mm -hmm. And they look at that. But when you mentioned Ginny and Mrs. Weasley getting up, I was like, hold on. We're, and so I like was on Reddit, looking up Reddit mm. theories, trying to figure it out. And the I couldn't really figure it out. Wording though. Yeah. Rising? So the, the linchpin yeah. right here, can I just put that together is the word rise. He was the first yep. to rise from the table. That is a very specific. <laughs> yeah, verb, wow, yeah. That's awesome. So whatever wow. the heck that means, I don't know. <laughs> I should have gone back and read the prophecy again. Or not prophecy, whatever it is. Come on, Danny, you're slacking. Yeah, seriously. Oof. Uh, you guys ready for the next chapter? Ready. Chapter 36. All right, I'm going to queue it all up. Except I'm going to go fast speed on my own. <laughs> this Sorry, one's shorter. Jenny. This one's only it's 20 minutes. It's not you. It's it is because of that. Because I can't listen to it fast. <laughs> 1.25? 25, <laughs> 25 minutes, and then we're good. This one was 45, so. We hear um, it. You guys hear it? You hear it already? No. Yep. Yes. Oh, wait. Hold on. I got to make this two headphones again. Okay. Here we go. We are going to start chapter 36 in... Hold on. One second. Let me let other people queue it up. All right. We're going to start in three, two, one, start. That hurts.
the That's not good.
<laughs> what a line.
down. <laughs> Good line. That's what you're going to focus on. <laughs> <laughs> There it is. Okay. <laughs> Yikes. It's intense. So intense. Isn't that duel so good? <laughs> so, that was crazy. Yeah, was cool. Doing stuff we've never seen before. I know, yeah. That's why you know they're the top two wizards, because they're doing stuff mm -hmm. that no one no one could do. Everyone's just sending stunners at each other, and these guys are like apparating yep. while they battle. They're like sending these <laughs> creatures at each calm, other. Too. He was like calm, like he just like didn't care. I was like, yes. 
such a good line. Yeah, calling him Tom feels like a perfect like yeah, insult, like, like, like yeah. childish. You yeah. know, it's so great. Yeah. Yep. It's like I still know you. Yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, that's people. That's like an all-time line people love. It was foolish for you to come here tonight, Tom. Oh, it's yeah. so good. There you go. There's our live read of these chapters. Wow. <laughs> wow. Finish it now. <laughs> I know. Everyone's saying too. There's like a point in these books where you you just can't put them down, and I'm forcing you guys to put them down. <laughs> You're yeah. making us put it. Uh, we don't have an option. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll stop. Mm. Um, that was a watch. Twelve hands on his I know, watch. I was like, what the heck? But he still looked at it to reference time. Yeah. Or did he? Is there 12 Dumbledores? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> or 12 members of his family? Yeah, like what are the, yeah. Um, oh, like the Weasleys? Yeah, like hers, yeah. but it's in Well, I was thinking, because Jen, you always reference, like he always knows what's going on. Hmm. It's like, is there 12 of him at like different points in time? Mm. <laughs> He's got to check. He's like, mm. hmm, where am I at right now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which half hour am I talking about? <coughs> but I'm sure it does more than tell time. But what does it indicate? Maybe one of them's for Harry's safety. Mm. You can just see what if Harry's in trouble. Mm. It would pretty much always be glowing or saying uh, Harry's in trouble. Jen, you're gonna love the next chapter. Mm. Lots Jen's of info. Like, Please get me out of here so I can mm. listen to it at normal speed. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's slow speed for me. <laughs> Can actually understand it <laughs> i still don't quite get what the how the fountain jumped in like mm -hmm. does the fountain always jump in to save people i thought that was dumbledore or, was a dumbledore yeah. move dumbledore. Yeah. i thought it was possible it was a reference to um harry dumping money in there before ah. but that's pretty crude at first just i paid thought on the most you know at first i thought it was just <laughs> like ah, yeah you're loyal wow what do you think, Kristen? At first, I thought it was a statue, like jumping in on its own to protect him. Just but then like it seemed like it was Dumbledore. Right? Mm. Like, yeah, Did you feel like that, Jen? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't think. Like Dumbledore's throwing this out before he can even get there. It's like, yeah. yep. protect mm. people until he can actually fully get there. Or is yeah. there much power that things just want to protect him? Yeah. Mm. Mm. Protects pure people, I don't know. Yeah. Because everyone knows Dumbledore. It feels like whatever Fudge said at the end made me think the the fountain was a little bit like it was a known thing that it could mm. jump in and help people or do something. Maybe they've never actually seen it jump to action. Isn't Fudge the worst, though? Fudge yeah. wins he the moron award. Not. Yeah, we gotta have a moron. He's an idiot. The voice he gives him is perfect. I'm like, he just sounds so annoying and dumb. Yeah. yeah. Just like... We'll just have a Fudge award. It's just like irritating. Fudge the motion. Yeah. Fudge yeah. It's just the dumbest that. idiot of the, the chapters. The dumbest <laughs> idiot. Fudge <laughs> honorary. It's oh, we're Fudge is yeah. cool. we're naming it after him. I'm glad he kind of couldn't say anything. Dumbledore called all the shots. Yeah. yeah. At the end, he was just like, "It is what it is. Here's what's happening. You know I'm right. Yep. I'm doing this. You're not gonna stop me." Mm -hmm. And Fudge at least didn't try to maintain control again well he, he couldn't accepted. yeah he literally there was couldn't proof he, he there would have been like an uprising at that mm. point mm -hmm. um yeah i couldn't tell if harry there was a brief moment when harry didn't realize all the people were there i was like wait were they in another dimension for some amount of time yeah because it felt so sudden um from our perspective it was like harry all of a sudden noticed all these people and i couldn't tell if that was just because he was in the moment um or if there actually was a change. But, mm. yeah, pretty intense. And I guess Voldemort must be kind of advanced if he's disapparating from there. Because I didn't think you could apparate or disapparate to the Ministry. Because everyone else is using Flu Network. Um, oh. But then again... No. That, is that a rule? Mm -mm. No, because Arthur see it. Just does everyone, it. He usually would, except for with Harry, he had to do the mm. old-fashioned way. I thought so. But it just seems weird that people would use the flu network instead of apparating then. But they have all these fireplaces. Everyone's using the flu network. I think it's just like appropriate travel. Mm. I feel like the same is true with us. Like, you can... I could, like, drive across someone's lawn, but I'm not going to drive across someone's ah, lawn. I guess it's like yeah. apparate. You can mm. apparate into the ministry, but it's not like... 
it's frowned down upon. Right. It would be like you take rude because you could just yeah. like blast in front of yeah, someone. For you're sure. just like walking and all of a sudden a person just appears yeah. right in front of you. Yeah. Mm. It'd be, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. The professional way. Yeah. 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 <laughs> hmm. <sighs> but we'll have a discussion about these chapters soon. So. Got to go back and take notes. I know. I know for real. Um, I'm tempted. <laughs> I do. You guys feel like? I mean, I feel like there's a lot to discuss in these these two chapters. I'm tempted to say just finish it and discuss four chapters, but I feel like that podcast would be oh gosh, four hours be long. long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mm. Especially the next chapter because the next chapter is a information download. There's only two left. Yeah, there's two yeah. chapters left. So let's just do these mm. two. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> let's try to record as fast as possible, nice. and then uh, and then you guys can read the next two, and then finish this book. Sounds cool with that? <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in for our live read. That was really fun. <sighs> that was intense. That was, yeah. That was very <laughs> got to process this. That was like a very different experience listening to it, too. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's pretty I'm cool. Glad Dumbledore's coming back. Yeah. Feels good. We're, uh, we'll, uh, we'll continue and talk about theories next time. I'll let you guys know when we're going to do the actual <laughs> podcast for these two chapters. But thanks for joining us on the live stream, and we will see you guys. Bye. Another time. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my rings. <laughs> 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 <laughs>